she's prettier than I am. So, we used the winch yesterday. And today, as you can see, it's kind of a bird's nest. I didn't want to do it perfectly until I was done. Because I didn't know if I'd be using it again, but now it's the next day. And we are gonna do it. Respool, whatever the term is. So, see, plenty of cable. Now, I can reach in and I can, uh, I can pull the clutch. And now, uh, I can pull it out. Yeah. Seriously, I can pull it out. <laughs> this is one of those things where teaching you exactly why you do it. It hasn't even been 24 hours. Nick, this way. It hasn't been 24 hours. And already it's hard to pull out. And that's why you do it. So, here's what I'm gonna do. Uh, I'm gonna grab this D-ring. And I'm gonna grab a strap the true strap and, and we are gonna we gotta get creative hopefully I don't embarrass myself if the true strap doesn't make it around me because thick Nick, this way. Come on. So, let's put the D ring in here. Put my pin in. And I am going to workhorse this son of a gun. Using my legs instead of my arms and my hands all bent over. Smart, not hard. All right, so that's my tool bag. It's heavy. It's probably 30, 40 pounds of metal in there. Probably not the best way of doing it. But by myself, I'm thinking this is the safest way of doing it. Safety first, right? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna winch it in. I'll guide the cable as it drags the tool bag through this freshly rained on thick icy snow. It sounds like a plan. The red light in the grill. I don't know if you can see it from the camera. This is not for show, although it does look good. It's for It's so that you know that there's power to the winch. Where are you? There it is. So.
So now I'm pulling so it stays tight to the rings. Kind of pull in in a nice, even fashion. I got it in here. In the rest. Are you parking at the tool bag, Nick? It's coming to get you, isn't it? The tool bag's coming to get her. tool bag brought half the snow with it, which made it even heavier. And you see that it's it's not bad. I mean, is it perfect? No. Have I ever done this before? No. Well, I've winched before, but it's always been with other people's stuff. So when I do that, I uh I never have to do the cleanup afterwards. You know, it was always when I was trail guiding. As the camera moves. And... Hey, we're good. I'm not complaining. I think that's uh, that's reasonably good for my first time. Uh, I, ch I got to inspect the entire cable. There was nothing wrong. Turn that to the side. I will show you the red light I was talking about in case you couldn't see it before. You see the, this red light lets me know there's power, but there's a switch in there, which the Lord knows I don't remember where I put it. And I could switch it to a white light. Let's get this out of here so we don't have any mishaps. All right. These are my lights that I was that I did. Just a bracket from uh, I don't know Ace Hardware, and I have a long cable, and I can pull it out and pull it wherever I need it to be. So if I'm, you know, got a flat or something, there's a lot. I mean, we're not even seeing it all here. And it's got a quick disconnect, so I can plug it into the to the roof if I need to. So this is a a reasonable mod, cheap too. The mod, the mag lights, a set of lights, set of magnets, and uh, these brackets. I think came out to under 40 bucks. So if you have the worn winch, you'll know that there's a compartment over here on the side. So I can shove all the cable in there. So it doesn't fall down. And then I can just tuck it in and it drops. And I adjust it the way I want it and it doesn't move. Ta-da! That was a, I don't know, I, I want to call it a tutorial, but I'm no expert. I watched a bunch of videos, I came outside, and I did it. I inspected my cable, I cleaned it, and then I tight, spooled it up nice and tight like it did when it came from the factory, or as close as I'm capable of doing by myself. So like if I had somebody else with me, I would have put the strap on them. Or I would have put the strap on a tree and I would, have, I would have used the weight of the vehicle. But you know what? This is better than not. So, I guess that's all I got. Time to go get stuck again. Bye.